Dozens and dozens of tiny frogs invading a family's home in Wilton. So the big questions are, how could something like this have happened and can it happen to you? CBS 13's Jasmine Hassan is getting answers for us. And my floor started moving, but it really wasn't moving. It was frogs. Tiny Sierra and tree frogs invading Deborah Knowles' home. Oh my word, look at all those. They were on the cabinets. They were going that way. They were under the couches. And Deborah's not alone. People on social media have been posting about this for the last 24 hours. They witnessed some of the biggest migrations they've ever seen. Last night it happened to a lot of us. That's because of the spring storm. They were around the corner. They were up behind my sink. The warm spring rain came at the perfect time for the frogs. Right at the right moment where all those tadpoles were metamorphosing, then this, this system just came in at the perfect time to allow all of these animals to move. And apparently, a lot of them moved right into Deborah's home. Or I think total there was probably about 150. We could be in for more rain this week and into next, but this invasion won't last. The first couple nights will be the most, and then it will slow down. There was even one in the lamp post when I was reading. Even if you do see some around your yard or in your home. They were all over. They were hopping clear across the room. They're not dangerous to humans or our pets. They're just living their lives just like you and me. <laughs> it was really kind of fun to see them and see their little webbed feet coming up and so it was a, it was a cool fun experience